What's going on, YouTube? Keep right here representing the movement towards improvement. MTI, no lie, do slot die, ba bang bang, ba bang bang. You know what it isn't, but you're about to know what it is. What's going on, you guys? Today's video, we are going to do a slow motion analysis of my buddy Blair's swing. Now, we're going to compare his swing from what it was at Stone Ridge in our course vlog to some of the work we were doing a couple days later to change his path on the downswing and kind of where his path is going at impact and slightly after. Let me show you guys what I mean. So if we look here, Blair's hitting utility driving iron on the left. He did not hit the shot in the course vlog. I was having him hit a few shots just to, so I could record his swing and he hit about a 45 yard snipe hook into out of bounds. So let me show you uh, some of the things I, work, I look for when it comes to path. Now, if we come down to this point, I'm gonna put a little dot right here at his club head and I'm gonna go down to right here and I'm just gonna draw a line between these two points, okay? And I want you to kind of see where the club is. You can kind of see how it's well below his hands right here, okay? Some of the, when I was working with Carl Welty, he showed me where the club head should be at certain points of the swing to kind of get a general idea of where path should be. So as you can see, this is definitely well below the hands. Now, if we go here on the right, this was a nine iron. He had about a 15 yard hook into the greenside bunker here on a par five. That was in the course vlog. And we'll do the same thing. We'll just put a little dot right here and draw a line right here as well. And we can tell these look very similar when it comes to the path. The, the club head is well under the hands and that's gonna usually promote a, a too, well, too far of an inside path. So now what I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna draw like a little target line path, okay? Where he's trying to get this ball to start, which should be eh, about right there. Now, if we look at the club, on around impact and a little past one, two, three, four, five, six, seven frames, you can see this club head is still right in the middle of that target line. And look how far right the ball's starting of where he actually wants it to start. So these big pushes or hooks when you're coming this far from the inside. And we'll do the same thing over here on the left. So if we want, this is about right center of the fairway. And look at this club, one, two, three, four, five, six frames, it's still touching that line. And we can see this ball starting well out to the right. And this actually snipe hooked about 45 yards over here to the left OB. Okay, so now let's take a look at some of the swing changes we made when he came out to uh, Woods Valley. Real simple stuff, you guys. We just put a pool noodle up there. I made a video on it. If you haven't seen that video, click on the annotation. Go check it out, my last video. And we'll do the same thing. So we'll bring him up. We'll bring him back down. Titter tatter, titter tatter, bang bang, billy billy walla. Put a little dot right here and we'll draw that same line. And now as you can see, it's touching his hands. The top of the club is touching his hands, so the club's being up more out in front of him, coming from a more outside path. Now this path is still actually on the inside, but it's obviously not as inside as it was. So that's another good thing we like to see. And we'll draw that target line view. Once again, he's trying to go right at this pin. And we'll bring that through to the fall through. And then one, two, three, three or four frames or three frames, he's already off that target line. So this club's traveling a lot more left. You can see where the ball's starting. It's starting just a smidge left of the target, maybe a yard, three feet. And we can also see this club face, actually, it's hard to see, it's a little blurry, but this club face angle wants to stay a lot more open. And as you can see, this one's rotating. So we got the one on the left, he's coming way too far from the inside, swinging out to the right. He's rolling the face down because of that, and he's slowing rotation, right? Just like an ice skater. When they're bringing their arms and hands closer to their body, closer to the center of mass, they can spin faster. And when this club starts going out there and traveling to the right, it slows down body rotation and makes it a more hands and arm swing. Where if he can get this club tracking a little more left around impact, that's going to help him rotate his body more and keep the club face more square during impact, resulting in straighter shots. <laughs> You're welcome. Ba -ba bang, bang, chooty, chooty, booty, booty, booty. Okay. Okay, driver time, baby. We love the drivers. So let's go to a driver swing at Stone Ridge and let's go to a driver swing at Woods Valley. Now, this driver swing on the left was actually not in the course flog. He hit his driver first in the course flog and then he wanted to try mine. And when he hit his in the course flog, he hit a low snipe hook into the fairway bunker. So he actually hit this drive better. So this is his better swing. And once again, we'll kind of show you the path. Okay, bing, 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 bango, bango. Um, and this is what I usually like to see with the path is it going right through the uh, right pocket. This might be just a smidge behind that. It's not too bad actually. And if we draw our little target line view, you know, this is about right center right here. We can see once again, one, two, three, four, five, six frames. The club face is really traveling out to the right 
add impact and pass impact and we can see the ball going way off to the right hit this one the right rough and if we go over here on to the right we'll check his path these are very these ones are very close very similar uh, camber angles and bango there we go so you can see this one's going more through his um, about almost his front pocket than as opposed to say this one right here so we can definitely tell this one on the right's a little more on top okay you can see that this one's a little more on top on the right and if we draw our tiger our target line view about right here we'll see that this club we put that little water bottle so we couldn't swing too far off to the right one two three four frames it's off to the left already and look where this ball's starting just a smidge left of the target I think this was a dead straight ball maybe a three yard cut and that's really gonna take it's really gonna try to that's gonna really eliminate the left side so as you can see I'll bring these both to around impact for you. you can just see how these are exiting at different places okay see how this one on the right is going way more left this one on the left is going way more right and obviously look where these balls are starting one's curving a lot and one's curving very little we can also see slightly how this club's exiting a little more left and this one's a little more out to the right so you guys Blair's a good player I knew his swing I said we can get his ball flight and a lot more straighter and more consistent just working on a couple simple things like path and where's pass going around impact as well so you guys so simple just a pool noodle and a water bottle and he was in straight shots um, right away so you guys if you guys like this video please give it a like also comment on any other tips or drills you would like to see what you need to be working on your swing let me know subscribe hit me up on facebook gabriel m Ryder, instagram pga tour driven check out my membership site links all down below you guys you know you know it's me it's me Cape. anyways you guys i'm teaching a lot more these days i got six lessons booked this week and i'm gonna start filming a lot more of the lessons I'm doing and what I'm working on with students to share with you guys. So this is Gabriel right here. Represent PGA Tour driven the movement towards improving MT. I know lad do this, I die, bang, bang. I'm out of here. Peace.